Okay, let's just review. You go to schoolofed.nova.edu. Over on the right side, see, there's the screen. Over on the right side, there's Shark Link. You click on that. Then what comes up is you're going to see the Nova Shark Link area. You type in the code. There you go. And then, you know, put in the password. Then what pops up is... Um, uh, right. You eventually get to um, a whole list of, well, well, you've got various different things that you can look at here. But the main thing is that you get this view. Now, this is just general. This is still on Nova Campus. And you go there for the student link. Right? And I think it's once you hit click here to see your courses, that takes you into. Um, wonder, no, we're still on Nova Campus now, right? And it's only when you go into trends that we start going into um, Blackboard. And there we are. Right now, you're in Blackboard Learn. See how that happens? And once you're in Blackboard, oh, you have to re-enter because now we're in Blackboard. Say, I had everything set up so you could just look at it, but you can redo this. That's nice. And, um, boom. Oh, come on. There we go. It, you, you know you're in Blackboard because it says up there, Blackboard. You, it helps you with your tasks, tells you what you're doing today, tells you what's coming up. We've got something called Illuminate, right side. And now here's course messages, syllabus, the course contact, is, that's pretty straightforward. You know, that's how to contact her. Illuminate is the session that everybody talks in, and then discussions is where we put our writing. So um, I think if I put on Illuminate, it will show you that the t the um, you, you have to have a uh, earphone and um, microphone, and then once you're in there. You're going to, um, there's some sort of a session, join the session live. It's not currently available, but then everybody's in it together. Um, they claim that they've had issues with this because you've got a lot of people coming in on the evenings, and so it gets very busy. You're doing it through the server of the university. So it depends on the bandwidth of the university. Down under discussions, what happens is that for each week, we have a post. Say there's like a post. And we're supposed to go in and make our post. So like main, this is the main thing that everybody's supposed We're supposed to come in daily because you never know um, what people have put up. And so um, these are the ones I have not read, and these are the ones I've read. What happened was that these people had already posted last week, and I posted something, made a comment on them, and now what's happening is um, new people arrived. Let's see if we can find some new people here. Yeah, there they are. These four people have arrived just in the last day, and so <laughs> out of them, they've all published some additional um, comments. And Oh, there's Introduction McCray. Hey, that's mine. Let's see what I put up. And what pops up is you, you're you supposed to write everything in third person. Okay. So I wrote something in third person. It's also attached, so I did it both. I both pasted it, and I have something that's attached. 
And then navigating here, I'm still learning how to navigate. Um, I think if I hit the left box, will it take me back? No, it just takes me back, and then you, you walk through the same level. So I want to go back, so I'll go back here to Discussions, and that'll take me to the top level. And here we are back at the top level. Um, what I can do is I can click on this, and it will give me the list of the unread posts just in order. So that's the number of participants. This is the number of unread posts. But I've already gone through in the first week um, 79 of those posts. No, 69 posts. And there's 23 that I need to do today. Okay. So I've decided to start keeping track of my time just so that we'd see. And um, I've had about an hour, I suppose, over three days. And then maybe another hour. And last night I put in three hours. So, so far this week I've gone five hours. And we haven't even met yet, right? Um, if this was a typical seminar, you might have a three-hour class time and then a three hours outside of class. I haven't even included the reading time related to this. This is um, non-reading of books time. So already we've spent more time than normally would be spent in class um, on things like, um, well, reading and, and, and writing preparing for class. And this is related to discussions. These are all related to discussions. So online does not mean slacking. It means it's a different type of communication and some of it has to be sideways. Um, at least uh, two-thirds of the talk is between uh, other uh, outside of the, um, the direct talking. Um, some of these posts are, are somewhat interesting. I mean, like, just to show you what a typical post looks like um, if you haven't had a chance to go in. Um, there's the usual um, discussions like, hey, I can't read this. Hey, there's um, some difficulty here. Um, I, I didn't get a chance to, you know, let's see what some, some people have done. Uh, so, here he, this is the first guy, right? And so he's doing his, uh, this is his first post. Then, I think, let's see, um, you, you click on one up there, up at the top, there's a flag here. So I'll click that, and this will be the beginning of, uh, you get a welcome, Jose. So now I have to read that. It's a little annoying to have to read these little short posts. The, um, the guideline is don't make a post unless you're making a specific um, co um, comment on the point. Now, this this first week, everybody's saying, oh, how nice it must be to live in your city. I've always meant to be there. Oh, how nice. And, uh, and then people write back and forth. This is what we do. And so, you know, here we've gone through five posts here, and we haven't really seen anything. So um, my view is that these kind of comments can be taken outside of the forum by, and, and th this is what some of the difficulty is, what should be in the forum and what should be outside of the forum.